Hey everyone, TechnoMentor here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix your iPhone cannot be backed up. If you're getting this message, you want to follow these steps to fix it. So let's get started. The very first thing here you want to do is go ahead and open up your phone here. Let's go ahead and check and we'll do the notification and we'll open the notification. And once you open up the notification, there's a couple things you want to go ahead and check out. First thing is you want to make sure you have a good strong internet connection through Wi-Fi or cellular data. If you don't, you can just put on airplane mode briefly and turn it back on and that does a quick network refresh. But you will need an internet connection in order to back anything up to iCloud. Now once you back up stuff to your iCloud, the other thing you want also to ensure is that you have enough storage on your iCloud drive. So by default you get five free gigs. So what you'll need to do is either delete any old backup that you have or upgrade to a bigger plan. You can get a bigger plan by clicking on get more storage and select one of these options that are available or you can do is delete some of the stuff that you have currently. So if you have old backup you can tap on it and then you can go ahead and review which of the backups you don't need. For example if you don't need a backup you can go ahead and delete delete that backup and remember uh, you go ahead and delete it for each of the phones that you have that you don't want the backup and that's going to free up space as well. And you can also review backups here by reviewing old backup. For example, if you didn't need a backup, you can go ahead and delete inactive backup as well. And that's going to free up your storage so that you can actually back up and now we're in the green. Now, if that isn't working for you, the next thing you want to go ahead and do is a manual backup. So after you're done with this, you're going to click on back in. This is going to be back in settings, iCloud, Apple ID, and then iCloud. And then you click on iCloud backup, and then you're going to manually back it up. Now, when you're backing up, make sure your phone has at least 20% or more charge, if not connected to a charger. And all you'll do is click on backup, and it will begin doing the backup for you right there. Now, let's say if this wasn't working for you, the next thing you want to do is from your Apple account here, you're going to sign out and sign back in. So you're going to click on sign out and then log back into your account just to make sure that there's no issue with your device. Now after you sign back in into it and if it's still not working, you're going to go ahead and basically do this method. You're going to quickly press and release volume up, volume down and then hold on to this side button until the screen goes completely black and the Apple logo appears. So I'll do volume up, volume down and I hold on to this side button just like this and we're going to wait for the complete phone to go completely black and the Apple logo to reappear before we let go of that side button. So we're going to wait and then we let go. This is going to force the phone to shut down and reload the code. So for a software related issue, it's going to go ahead and fix that. And if it doesn't work the very first time, just keep on trying. It's just quickly pressing and release volume up and then volume down one after another in sequence before holding down this side button and then once you're back on again make sure you have more than 20 percent charge connected to the internet through wi-fi or cellular data and then go back into your setting and then your apple account and then icloud and try to do a backup now and that should go ahead and back up your phone and i hope this video was helpful if so please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iphone we'll see you guys next time